Hi everybody. April 10, 2018. China to make it rain over area three times the size of Spain. I want to thank my subscriber for sending this along to me. You know, <laughs> we are living an unbelievably surreal life now. It, it, it's hard to understand how it is that people are denying weather modification. Oh God, when there is so much evidence of it. But what, what do people do with this information that comes from mainstream media, RT? Do they just say, oh, RT, well that's Russian propaganda about China. Do they just never look into it? But it's been in mainstream media, Western mainstream media. The Guardian reported on geoengineering projects going on all over the world. Oh my God. Oh, how do you deal with this insanity? Yeah, China now will be making rain three times the size of Spain. Since 2013, China has been creating 55 billion tons of artificial rain a year. The country is now embarking on its biggest rain-making project ever. I will link below to this article and circulate it to those that don't believe you, still believe that nothing has changed in the sky. It's all perfectly normal. And Mother Nature, God, still in control of our weather. Maybe, maybe this will crack open their closed minds. Um, according to media reports, the government will use new military weather altering technology developed by the state-owned China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation. The country plans to build tens of thousands of combustion chambers on Tibetan mountainsides. The chambers will burn a solid fuel which will result in a spray of silver iodide billowing towards the sky. Okay, um, I hope you're all doing okay. It really is a very bizarre time we are living. But listen to this, sprayed from planes, the particles will provide something for passing water vapor to condense around, forming clouds. Those clouds will bring the rain. A single cloud seeding chamber could create a strip of clouds covering a five kilometer area. Traditionally, the rain-making process of, or cloud seeding means rocket launching chemicals into clouds which accelerate the creation of ice crystals that eventually become rain. China also uses military aircraft for those purposes. Rain-making is also a popular way to clean up air in China, where heavy smog is a big problem for Many cities, the practice of weather modification has become more frequent across the country in recent years, including for major public events in, 28, in 2008, sorry, China launched over 1,100 rockets containing silver iodide into Beijing skies before the Olympics opening ceremony to disperse clouds and keep the Olympics rain-free. Beijing has a development plan for weather modification until 2020. <laughs> Do we think it's only China? Is that, is that what people will think when they read this article? Oh, it's only China. And they've only been doing it recently. When we, it's known, it's out there, we have been modifying the weather for a very, very long time. But when, it's, when we've been doing this in wars, Vietnam War, 
to uh, muddy the roads so the Viet Cong could not travel on them. All of this is known. How is it that we can't get through to people? Oh, wow. It's just a wow. What can you say about the time we're living? But, wow. <laughs>